Hello students. Let's continue our journey through understanding quadrilaterals. Today we are going to discuss a special parallelogram rectangle. See this board. Can you guess its shape? Yes, it's a special type of parallelogram. What's special in it? All angles are equal. In this parallelogram suppose, angle K equals X degrees, since all angles are equal, angle L equals angle M, equals angle N, equals angle K, equals X degrees. We know that the sum of the interior angles of a quadrilateral is 360 degrees. So angle K plus angle L plus angle M plus angle N equals 360 degrees. That is X degree plus X degree plus X degree plus X degree equals 360 degrees. That is, 4x degree equals 360 degrees. Therefore, x equals 360 divided by 4 equals 90 degrees. That is KLMN is a parallelogram with each angle 90 degrees. These kinds of parallelogram are called rectangle. A rectangle is a parallelogram with each angle 90 degrees. So a rectangle has all the properties of a parallelogram. In rectangle KLMN, the diagonal KM and LN meets at O. Since it is a parallelogram, the diagonals bisect each other. That is, OK equals OM, and ON equals OL. Let's compare the lengths of its diagonals. Are they equal? Yes, the length of both diagonals is equal. Let's prove this mathematically. Consider the triangles, triangle KLN and triangle LKM. KN equals LM. Opposite sides of a rectangle are equal. Angle NKL equals angle KLM equals 90 degrees. KL equals KL, common side. Therefore, triangle KLN is congruent to triangle LKM. NL and KM are the corresponding parts of these two triangles. That is, the diagonals of A, rectangle are equal. Let's summarize what we learned today. A rectangle is a parallelogram with each angle 90 degrees. The rectangle has the following properties. 1. The opposite sides are parallel and equal to each other. 2. Each interior angle is equal to 90 degrees. 3. The diagonals bisect each other. 4. Both the diagonals have the same length. Let's see, how can we apply these properties to solve problems? In rectangle ABCD, the diagonals AC and BD intersect at O. If AO equals 4Y plus 3 and DO equals 2y plus 9, then find the length of its diagonal. Given that ABCD is a rectangle with diagonals AC and BD intersecting at O. Also AO equals 4y plus 3 and DO equals 2y plus 9. We have to find the length of the diagonal for that first we compute the value of y. We know that, in a rectangle, the diagonals have the same lengths and bisects each other. That is, AC equals BD. 
half of AC equals half of BD. That is, AO equals DO. Which means, 4Y plus 3 equals 2Y plus 9. Transposing like terms we get. 4Y minus 2Y equals 9 minus 3. That is, 2Y equals 6. Transposing 2 to RHS. Therefore, Y equals 6 by 2 equals 3. Substituting the value Y equals 3 in AO such that AO equals 4Y plus 3 equals 4 multiplied by 3 plus 3 equals 12 plus 3 equals 15. That is, AO equals 15 units. Since AO equals DO, DO is also 15 units. The length of the diagonal is 2 times AO or 2 times DO. AC equals BD equals 2 multiplied by AO equals 2 multiplied by DO. That is, AC equals BD equals 2 multiplied by 15 equals 30 units. Therefore, the length of the diagonals of the rectangle ABCD is 30 units. Before winding up, let's check how much you understood by doing an activity. The length of a rectangle is 8 cm, and each of its diagonals measure 10 cm. Find its breadth. That's all for now. See you all in the next class.